we have come today rejoicing into the house of the Lord for the celebration, my dear brothers and sisters. And now we stand with Ryan and Hillary on the day they intend to form a home of their own. It is my distinct pleasure to announce and present to you the newly married Mr. and Mrs. Ryan and Hillary Griffin. Put your hands in the air 
Clap them as loud as you can for the new Mr. and Mrs. Brian and Hillary Richter. Hello, I'm Travis. I am Ryan's older brother. Uh, Ryan and I are a year and a half apart. Most of the time, uh, we did everything together, but most of the time we were killing each other. Like throwing them through a window or swinging golf clubs all the way across the yard and hitting them right in the back. And then I'd go hide in the bathroom. Um, no, but all seriousness, I, I'm so happy to have Ryan as a, as a brother. Um, he's been there through everything through my whole life, uh, growing up as kids, and even being there uh, after, after school, we lived together for how many years? And we worked together, so we saw each other every single day um, until my life started with my wife. Um, and I, I couldn't be more happier that he was there for my journey that I'm going through right now in my life. And I can't wait to be there for their journey that they're going to be going through. So, Ryan, I love you. And even though I can still kick your butt and everything. In all seriousness, no, Ryan, I, I love you. I miss you. And I'm so happy that you're my brother. The one thing I always hoped for Hillary was that she'd find a great guy to spend the rest of her life with. That's why I'm so happy that she found Ryan. They fit perfectly together. Ryan's very patient, laid back, and easygoing, which are all musts in order to deal with the Larson girl. They want the same things in life, value the same things, and have the same interests. We're a very athletic family. We love playing sports and are extremely competitive. The moment I knew Ryan was going to fit in well with our family was when Hill and Ryan, Brandon and I, and Shane and Kendra had planned a golf day. For the girls, this meant a day outside getting a tan while having some drinks. For the guys, this meant a day of shit talking about who's better and betting on everything possible. When we arrived at the golf course, Hillary told me that on the way there, Ryan looked over to her and said, you have to try your best because we have to beat them. And that's when I knew he would fit right in. <laughs> I think my then two-year-old son, Hendricks, who has no filter, said it best as to how our family feels about Ryan for Hillary. The second time he met Ryan at my parents' house, he walked up to Ryan, looked him straight in the eyes, and said, I love you, Ryan. I just want to say, I don't know how happy it makes me to really see two families coming together like this. And the, the thing is, we're pretty much one family to start with, so it's a little messed up, but it's fine. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, I have nothing written down. I have nothing else to say. All I wanna see is Ryan and Hillary kiss one more time, and let's give them a round of applause, huh? Searching 